Hi guys, it's Tracy from Brownell Creative. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a hamburger menu um, using the Lightbox feature. And what we want to do is we want to create a lovely full screen menu, which is going to link to this hamburger icon here. Um, and we're going to do this using the Lightbox feature. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add our Lightbox. And we're going to just select any light box for now because we're going to customize it. So what we're going to do is get rid of this information. And we're going to stretch out our light box. We're going to open it up nicely. And we're going to change the color to match the colors of the site and if you look over here this is your overlay so what we want to do is we want to change that to match the color of the light box right so there's our light box background now what we need to do is we need to add a menu so we're going to go add, right, and we're going to select menu, and for this purpose we're going to use a vertical menu. So there's our pages and our menu, but as you can see we need to customize it so it's nice and big, so we're going to go design, and we're going to customize it. We're going to change it to white. We're going to make the font uh, quite a bit bigger. And I think we should make it bold. So we'll just choose a bold font. And when we hover over it, we want it to be black so it matches the colors of the site. And when it's clicked, we want it to be black so that it fits in nicely. Right? We want to center align the menu tabs and we want to position it nicely in the center. So you see that little purple line, that's, that little guard line that's popped up? That's telling you that you're nicely centered. Right, and we want to open it up a bit so that it's the line spacing is there. We go, voila, that's our menu. Right, so that's our menu setup. And if you preview, you'll see as it hovers, as you hover over it, it's changing color. But what we want to do is we want to set up the actions on this. So we'll set up a trigger. Um, we don't want this light box to automatically display on the pages. What we want to do is we want it to open up when we click on the menu icon. So we'll say no. And we're going to rename it here. <clears throat> menu. So right now we're going to exit the light box and we're going back to our icon and what we're going to do is we're going to link to that light box menu that we've just created. So we want to change the link, scroll down to light box, we've only got one light box so we'll say done, and click preview, there's your menu and you can close it using X and that's going to give you your menu. So that's a really useful tool um, if you want to create a lovely big full page menu for your website.